The stim glitch is back in Warzone and it's still as OP as ever. I am making this video to raise awareness for any players who have lost a game due to this glitch, but also to show developers how players are abusing this glitch in order to get unfair wins in the gas and have zero competition. So I am going to show the steps that players are taking in order to use this and abuse it. The first thing players are doing is when they spawn in, they are trying to get a frag grenade in their lethal slot for their pregame class, so they keep respawning until they finally get a frag grenade. Once the frag grenade is obtained, they then have to go down to the ground and find a wall or somewhere to bounce that grenade off. Once they are down and found a secure spot, they then have to wait until the timer is at 3 seconds. When the timer is at 3 seconds, they are going to throw the grenade at the wall and then hold their grenade back while the timer is going down and the plane is flying in. If there is not a skull on the map where the player was when they threw the grenade, then that means that they did the glitch successfully. And there are two things that can happen. The first thing is they could just go ahead and land and find any tactical if they find a stim then they would already be good to go. But this does work with every tactical in the game except for the heartbeat sensor and the spotter scope. So do not pick those up. If those are picked up, then it will not work. But if players go ahead and find a stun grenade or a stim or a flash, then or even a smoke, then they will be able to do it. Once the stim is acquired, you can see here that it can now be used unlimited times and that's how players are staying in the gas. You can see here the player is using it repeatedly, but it doesn't tick down. It stays there forever. This results in players being able to survive in the gas for an unlimited amount of time and un just get unfair wins, basically. This will also work with other tacticals, like I said. So the flash grenade, the stun, and the smoke can also be used in this manner. As you guys will see here, I'm showcasing that you can throw this flash grenade multiple times and obviously you should only have one i just threw about five right there and then just go ahead and pick up the stim glitch and it'll keep going you'll keep stimming and you can stay alive in the gas for an unlimited amount of time this also works with loadout drops so when players go to pick up their loadout if they have a stim or any tactical besides the heartbeat sensor and the spotter scope then it will continuously work and they can stay in the gas forever to get unfair wins. I do not condone the use of this. However, if you choose to do it, please make sure that you guys accept the risk that you are taking and read the disclaimer in the description. Leave a like on this video to help share awareness and tell the developers that they need to fix this now because Warzone is extremely broken.